mountains, stretching for hundreds of kilometers. Our natural boundary between China's north and south. Over a thousand years ago, Li Bai, a poet of the Tang Dynasty, wrote, "The road to Shu is harder than scaling the sky afar." This line showed the difficulty of crossing the Qingling Mountains. Today, with high-speed railways linking Xi'an to Chengdu, Chengdu to Guiyang, Chengdu to Chongqing, Chongqing to Zhengzhou, and Chongqing to Changsha, the once daunting Shu Road has become a happy journey. This transformation is a glimpse into how high-speed rail is revolutionizing transport across China. China's high-speed rail, creating a better life. In recent years, under the leadership of the Chinese government, China's high-speed rail has experienced rapid, groundbreaking development. A vast and sophisticated high-speed rail network has taken shape, built upon the eight north-south and eight east-west corridors, crisscrossing the land with seamless connectivity, spanning 48,000 kilometers and reaching 97 percent of cities with populations exceeding 500,000. China. Has established a world-class high-speed rail technology system, encompassing engineering, construction, equipment manufacturing, and operation management. Engineering challenges posed by complex terrains have been overcome through innovation, resulting in the completion of numerous projects such as long tunnels and bridges. The Fuxing EMU, with a top operational speed of 350 kilometers per hour, is a shining example of China's railway innovation. An advanced, efficient, and secure operational system underpins this network. The daily number of EMU trains operated nationwide can exceed 10,000. With the passenger volume surpassing 16 million, China also boasts the world's largest real-time tickling platform, with peak daily sales exceeding 26 million tickets. High-speed rail has profoundly transformed the mobility for people, cutting travel time by more than half for many routes. And redefining the way people move, it has brought China's east, west, north, south, and central regions into closer contact, significantly promoting balanced regional development. It has catalyzed urban development and industrial growth along its corridors, witnessing the meteoric rise of new high-speed rail cities. And forming golden belt of tourism and commerce. Beyond this national impact, high-speed rail has become a powerful conduit for global connectivity and cultural exchange. From the Jakarta Bandung High-Speed Railway in Indonesia, a symbol of rapid progress, to the Hungary Serbia Railway that brought high-speed dreams to the Balkans. More and more people around the world are embracing the quality of life high-speed rail makes possible. Yeah, one good thing new. <laughs> Today, China will further promote the development of high-speed rail network in a wider, faster, more intelligent, and greener direction. Wider, by 2035. China's high-speed rail network will span 70,000 kilometers, covering every Chinese city with over 500,000 people. 
faster. Implement the CR450 innovation program to achieve the goal of commercial operation at a maximum speed of 400 km per hour. More intelligent, AI-driven technologies will ensure greater safety, comfort, and efficiency in operations. Greener, eco-friendly practices and technologies will foster harmony between real development and the natural environment. Looking ahead, China's high-speed rail will not only serve as a key driver of Chinese-style modernization, but also become a vital global public good. For all people around the world, it will be an inclusive vehicle to enjoy better travel, deeper connection, and a brighter, more beautiful life.